when I was in Nepal, my wife was going with the Tibetans, learning how to weave. And I was going from monastery to monastery because at that time, you know, I was really struggling with a purpose in life and going through India and meeting like the, the burning in uh, Varanasi and all that, the Hindus and all that, you know. So I, I was really attracted to it. Buddhism. It was a lifestyle, a spiritual lifestyle and a discipline. And I was really interested in Buddhism. And that's how I got inspired to do the prayer. We, you go to the temples in Swambu, Bognat, or anywhere in the Buddhist temples, uh, you know, uh, in India and all that, you see them going around, touching the things, the prayer wheels. It's a special, you know, it uh, gives you a certain feeling of contact, you know, because what I did, I took the center of that work out of the center. So when you concentrate, you are going to concentrate to the center, but that moves and that's going to play on your brains and you're going to lose your balance. You spin it, you know, and there you, you're in admiration. It stays with you. It's like an imprint I do on your mind, you know.